Okay, a minute ago I was showing how when I replugged the unit in, I couldn't get the uh, run lines to run. Got the connect run done here. Plug this back in. And the 5 and 12 on the side are not coming up. Now, what's happening over here, I've discovered, is you've got the last test I went ahead and tied through a resistor uh, logic 3.3 volts to pin 12, which is system power up buffer. When you do that, you pull this pin high, the gray pin, pin 12, it goes through and shuts off the ones that are called power supply with run. Shuts this off. And I couldn't figure out what was going on. And after goofing around, I found that this pin, if I go through and... Uh, now, I've unplugged the computer and undone the uh, AC cord and plug it back in. This has been dead. If I take the connector over here plug it back into the motherboard and then pl turn the computer uh, plug the cable on it will turn on so what's happening is that the motherboard is actually going through and tying this pin uh, pulling it low to ground what's happening it's latched high in the supply for some reason when I plug it back in so I've got the pl thing plugged in now and I can go over here, and I've got no 5 and 12 volts on the run side. If I go through and tie this to gray, that's what I did to turn this off. If I go through and tie the gray to ground, if I just touch this, it tends to go. That's because I'm physically a ground. If I go through and pull this down to ground and leave it there, then it's on over here. And if I unplug this, it's on. So what's going on here is that this, on the 14 pin 2006 iMac here, if I go through and take this gray connector, which is system power up L buffer, if I pull it to high, it goes and shuts off run, run, run on 3, 5, and 12 volts. If I go ahead and make sure this is pulled down to ground and not floating around logically, this is really at ground to take a resistor tie here to one of these black pins. Uh, it goes ahead and turns the run on again. So a minute ago I was plugging this on and off. What was happening is the thing was an undetermined state. So I can take this and go through and tie it high, and it's off. So the 5 and 12 volts is off over here on the run side, which is 3 volts run, 5 volts run, 12 volts run on the 14-pin connector. If I go through, take that, and tie it to ground, or I'm just holding on to it. That's why I've got intermittent results because sometimes just me being sort of touching ground, it pulled it down. You notice if I touch this, it gets kind of screwy. It's because I've got a little bit of voltage on me. I'm charged up. Tie it to high, it's on. So they turn on, this is turned on by pulling this pin. So what I've learned here is that the this side, the 3, 5, and 12 are always on. This side, which is called the run, the 3, 5, and this 12 are turned on and off by this gray wire, which is called cistern power off buffer. So if I pull this with a resistor to logic, say 3 volts, turns this off. If I pull this back to ground, turns it on. 
this pin here if I go tie that to logic 3 volts there we got the backlight on which is cool and I still don't know what these other two pins are doing so what I may do here it's an experiment I may go through here and just see when I toggle this back and forth, does this pin actually go through and have something on it? Right now, I've got it to where the run is on. The run side voltages are on. And I'm going to go measure between power good and ground. What do we have? It's just kind of floating just a few tenths of a volt. Now pull it high. What is it? Same thing. Pull it low. Hey, you plug it in the wrong one, it'll be exciting here. So, power good might not be an output off of this pin. I can't seem to move it around by toggling this side on and off. And I also have this white connector, which I'm not sure what does invert CPU again. Measure that to ground. Nothing. Let's go ahead and turn that on again, the run side. Nothing. So I got all pins, I know what they are except for these two. Power good, of course, is probably a power good either so, uh, output, but on mine I can't seem to get it to toggle back and forth. Nor can I figure out right now what that is, but Maybe somebody else can help me with that. Anyways, here's the 5 and 12 on the, what they call the run. I can go through, pull it high, turn it off. This is the SATA connector for the hard drive that got disconnected. I can go through, I pulled it out, and this pin is just floating around. It doesn't know what to do. It's still off. So it's actually latched high. So what I'm going to do is take this thing, because I've touched that. That's why it came on, because I'm sort of at ground. I'm just standing with rubber shoes on here. But that's why I've gotten screwy results turning the thing on and off. Uh, if I pull it logically to ground with a little resistor here, uh, it's on. Kind of interesting. Anyways, it's a 2006 iMac. It's an EM2105. Core Duo. It's a 32-bit CPU. So I'm trying to figure out what the 14-pin connector is. Now I've already figured out what all these are, except for these two. I don't fully understand what they're for. So if anybody else has anything they can help out on a 14-pin connector, for the power good and the invert CPU high, what the exact functions are of that. Um, I can't seem to, by turning this on and off, I can't seem, it seems like this is always on mine, ground, and also this is close to ground. Now, I'm not sure, I might have a problem, my inverter board on here may not work, and so fully, and maybe that's why my computer's dead, so maybe 
uh, this is supposed to go high and I've got a bad uh, bad inverter CPU. The way this works is that the main power supply here puts out 12 volts, goes to the inverter, uh, LCD inverter, the LCD inverter powers the LCD up here with the backlights and it also puts out 3 volts and 5. So the 3 and 5 volts are derived uh, from the 12, DC goes in here, this is a DC to VC inverter, you get the 3 and 5 volts out of this. So it might be that mine is in a compromised mode or I fully, still don't fully understand what these pins are for.